Hi guys, welcome to AC Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix touchpad not responding in Windows 11. There can be a several reasons why the touchpad on a laptop is not working. Some of the most common reasons are outdated or missing touchpad drivers, disabled touchpad, physical damage or hardware issues, software conflicts, power management settings, operating system issues, touchpad settings and BIOS issues. However, don't worry, here's the simple steps to fix touchpad not working on laptop. So let's get started. First, you all have to do is press Windows and X key on your keyboard. Press down arrow key to select the device manager and then press enter. After that, press Tab key. Press down arrow key to select mice and other pointing devices. Then, press right arrow key to expand it. Select mouse or touchpad device and press Enter. Press the Tab key until the general tab is highlighted. Press the right arrow key to select the driver tab. After that, press Tab key to select Update driver and press Enter. Select Search automatically for drivers and press Enter. That's it. After that, check once and your problem should be solved. If this method is not worked, then try this second method. Look for a physical button or switch on your laptop. Many laptops have a physical button or switch on the keyboard or the side of the device that can turn the touchpad on or off. The button or switch may have a touchpad icon. Press or slide the button or switch to toggle the touchpad on or off. Some laptops allow you to enable or disable the touchpad by pressing a combination of keys on the keyboard. In my device, function plus F7 key combination have given to enable and disable the touchpad. So I'll be press function key and F7 key simultaneously to check if it's working. Ok, as you can see it is working properly. In case if it doesn't work, then press and hold the function key and while you holding it, press all remaining function key except F7 key. The key combination may involve pressing the function key and one of the function keys that has a touchpad icon on it. After that, hopefully your problem will be solved. But unfortunately, if it doesn't work, then try this third method. First, you all have to do is press Windows key and X. Now using down arrow to select device manager. And then press enter. When device manager is open, press tab key. Now use down arrow key to select mice and other pointing devices. Press right arrow key to expand it. Select your mouse or touchpad device by using down arrow key and then press enter. Now press the tab key until the general tab is selected. Press the right arrow key to select the driver tab. After that press tab key to select update driver and press enter. Using down arrow key to select browse my computer for drivers. Select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Then press enter to open it. Select the hardware and model of your device and press enter. After that press tab key to select next button. And press enter. Ok as you can see the message windows was successfully updated your driver. Now check once your touchpad issues fix or not. If you are lucky then this simple method may solve your problem. But unfortunately if it doesn't work then try this fourth method. Sometimes you can enable the touchpad on your laptop by uninstalling the touchpad driver and a simple restart. This may reinstall the touchpad driver. First open device manager. When device manager is open, press tab key. Now use down arrow to select mice and other pointing devices. Press right arrow to expand it. 
select your mouse or touchpad device and then press enter now press the tab key until the general tab is selected press the right arrow key to select the driver tab press the down arrow to select uninstall device press enter to select uninstall device press enter again to uninstall it now restart your computer by pressing all plus f4 key combination Now check once if your touchpad is working or not. Unfortunately, if all these previous methods are not work, then try this final method and I'm sure it will solve your issue. Here you can enable the touchpad using the registry editor. So, let's take a closer look at the procedure. Press Windows key to open the start menu. Now type regedit and press enter to open it. Press left arrow to select yes and then press enter. Select H key local machine and press right arrow to expand it. Press down arrow to select software folder. Again press right arrow to expand this folder. After that select the Microsoft folder by using the down arrow and press right arrow to expand it. Now go down to select windows folder and press right arrow to expand it. Then select current version and press right arrow to expand it. After that go to policies folder by using your arrow keys. And again press right arrow to expand it. Now go down to system folder then use tab key to access the options. Go down to select cursor separation and press enter. Now change the value 1 to 0 and press enter to apply the changes. Now press alt plus ctrl plus delete on your keyboard. Now press the tab key until the power button is selected. Press enter to expand the menu. Now select restart and press enter. That's it. After that, check once and your problem should be solved. So I hope this simple guide was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide, then please let us know. Please like, comment, share. We need your support. And guys, don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.